Hi guys, I'm just starting the vlog off now because I'm sure I will probably forget when I've actually gone out. But today, me and Ben and his uncle are going to go to a German market, which is like festive little like trinkets that they sell and lights and things like that. So I thought it'd be fun to bring you along. I was going to be really productive this week and film every day and edit every day. But I had a bug which could only be described as the work of the devil because it was horrible. I was bedridden for two and a bit days. I felt horrible. I had no energy. I couldn't eat anything. Everything was just coming back out of me and it was just vile. But I'm slowly starting to feel like myself again. So I thought that I would make the most of my time off before I start my new job. And so I've decided to do a little festive vlog. And if you notice this jumper in another video, it's because I'm also going to be filming a baking video today. I'm basically just um, like pre-filming and pre-editing as much as I can. So things will be a bit of a mishmash in terms of real time and when I actually upload it. For example, my roots are absolutely hideous. But I'm getting them done on Friday, but because I've pre-filmed so many videos, it will look like I haven't got them done ever. If that makes sense, I'm kind of rambling. It actually really aches to hold up a vlogging camera. Look how fluffy it is. I feel like I look really tired and like my face looks really... What's the word? Really shrunken in. Gaunt. I feel like I look really tired and gaunt and pale because I've been so ill I haven't hardly eaten anything. For two days all I had was two pieces of toast but last night I managed to have half a bowl of pasta as well. So yeah I still feel a bit iffy I'm not 100% myself which you might be able to see in my videos but I'm just gonna get on with life and do everything I need to do and have a good time while I do it at least try to and i'm really rambling now so i'm just gonna shut up and you're gonna see the vlog and see our day at the german market and then i'm gonna combine it with tomorrow where we're going to london to see some christmas lights as well so yeah that is everything i have to say for now and just keep on watching to see our little festive day out let's go <laughs> Bye bye. Cut down, Copen. Cut down, Copen. collect um what are these called these are crystals amethyst just in general gemstones yeah oh did you just have the gemstones i used to collect that? stuff like this oh <laughs> you both well, like from the gift shops yeah. on holiday yeah, yeah. yeah.
What does it taste like? Good. What's your verdict, Mike? Is it any different to English beer? Um, yeah. You know what I'm like with alcohol though. Are you filming this? <laughs> Megan hates it. Oh, that's hideous. How is that hideous? Give me your verdict. It's horrible. Why? <laughs> You're very close to my I'm face. I'm not. I don't know, it's just really bitter. But it's quite weak afterwards. I'm not, I'm not exactly a big I like it. One. like yourself or pretty until like you've got a certain thing done or touched up so some girls it's their fake nails some girls it's their fake tan for me it's my root but I'm getting them done tomorrow which is good um and I look really tired and really pale because like I said yesterday I have been getting over an illness and it's kind of sucked the life out of my face but I am feeling a lot better today which is good I don't look a lot better but I'm feeling a lot better. So yeah, yesterday was really fun. We went to the German market, as you saw. Unfortunately, Ben's mum couldn't come with us, so it was just me, Ben, and his uncle. So yeah, I wasn't feeling great at the start, but then I think the fresh air helped me, and now I think I am finally over my illness. The problem is that my stomach has shrunk from not eating properly in days. So I'm just trying to get my energy back, get used to eating properly, like three meals a day. So I'm still kind of recovering but feel a lot more like myself. So today we are going to see some Christmas lights in Kew Gardens which is in London. I'm really excited, the only thing I'm not excited for is the two hour drive down there which probably wasn't a good idea but I really wanted to go so oh well. What else? So I just made me and Ben a packed lunch which is cute. So we've got ham and cheese sandwiches, we've got celery, cucumber, pepper, strawberries and then two of the cookies that I made yesterday. I think I mentioned briefly yesterday about my new job um, but I thought that I'd explain it properly since I've got a bit of time before I need to leave. So I graduated from uni this summer and I had, I had a bit of time off and then I worked with my dad for a bit but that was only temporary. And then I was looking for a job and I actually got a job over almost two months ago but I still haven't started which sounds ridiculous. Yeah so I got the job two months ago but um, it's a job that requires a DBS check and references and the DBS check took a little while and then my references were quite hard to chase up. Uh, so yeah, I still haven't started. I've got my induction on Saturday and then I start properly on Monday so it's kind of good that my sickness came when it did so that I didn't have to miss any time off my new work. But I'm really excited. It's I think it's a job that I'm going to enjoy even though I don't know if it's a lifetime career. We'll see. I've got a second job, an internship with a media company doing like production work, but that's only part time. Um, so I'll be working two jobs and trying to do YouTube at the same time for six weeks. So January is going to be pretty hectic. If you want to stay updated with my life and what's going on, I am pretty active on Twitter. So for example, people might not know that I've been ill, but on Twitter I've put it, say like when I was like my new job, if I've done anything that day, just like everything's on Twitter and Instagram, which I will leave linked below and it's at the start in my intros as well. So check that out if you are interested in finding out what I do in between each video. And I think that's it. I am feeling so much better. 
and I am ready for these Christmas lights. You know what I was going to film today? Decorating my room Christmassy. But the loft scares me and my mum didn't get down the Christmas decorations and I'm not going up there on my own. There's spiders and it's dark and it's, you know, the ones where the floor isn't proper. There's floorboards and in between the floorboards there's this thing that you can't stand on otherwise you will fall through it. It's one of those and I'm not going up there when I don't know what's what. So yeah, next time you see me I will probably be in the car with Ben on the way to Christmas lights. Tell them where we're going. We're going to Kew... I've already said. Say it again. We're going to uh, Kew Gardens. We're going to Poo Gardens. It's my favourite song. It's not. I'm I, the most mature person you've ever met. If our age was our maturity, I'd be double your age. No, you wouldn't. Yes, yeah, would. you would. No, you'd be about 80 because you're an old woman. Oh, sweet love of mine. We've got a tin foil of sandwich each. So that's what, one sandwich each? There's two sandwiches. Only one sandwich? You've got two sandwiches. No, what, how many pieces of bread? Two. That's one sandwich then. Oh. Then it's one piece of, two bits of bread and it makes one sandwich. He's so grateful. What kind of rations of ham is that? It's the kind of, it's the amount of ham you give to your cat. I'm a grown man. He was once a vegan. Would you believe it? No, I wasn't. She talked shit. For my fitness Instagram, at Ben Pollard underscore, underscore, underscore. I can never get it right. <laughs> underscore. I can never say it. You say it. Ben Pollard underscore fitness. Why take a bite in the middle of a story? <laughs> you stress me out. Yeah, so. I wanted to try We're sat different in traffic types of by foods. the way, I'm not just not looking at the road. I wanted to try different types of foods. So I tried some vegan, veganism. I thought, rather than just saying, oh, I'm gonna eat a couple of vegan foods. I thought, oh, sorry. I thought, wait, hang on, it's better. Yeah, I thought I'd actually try and go fully vegan for a week just to really immerse myself in the, so she talks shit. Was that it? Was that the story? Mm. I quite like vegan food actually. Um, I'm not motivated enough to go fully vegan, but um, if there's like a vegan or vegetarian menu, I often actually choose those ones at restaurants. You're such a hero. Why are you trying to look good for the vlog? I need to look good for the vlog. It's going, you know, you're famous. Sure. <laughs> you enjoying that so much. Do you want to hear what else you've got? Yeah? So there's also a tub of celery, cucumber, red pepper and strawberries. And then you've got one of my homemade cookies and a can of coke. Babe, go, go babe, go. No, it's dangerous. Right, on the vlogs, either we're always listening to Justin Bieber or you're always eating. You're eating in all of the vlogs I've done. <laughs> Are you sure I need to be in this lane? Well, no. Everything's riding on me now. Go on, go, 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 go. Now stay in that lane. <sighs> oh, sometimes driving scares the shit out of me. Am I gonna get pat lunches like this when we live together? If you make it yourself, I'm not your mum. Did you enjoy that? No, it would have been better if you put some tomato ketchup in it, but. Uh, people in London drive so dangerously like no one needs to get somewhere fast enough that they'll risk their life for it are you eating all the pepper <coughs> with no cucumber are you eating all the cucumber yeah. don't be a dick this is why i'm not making you pack lunch how am i supposed to get in that lane when no one lets me in it oh, do you want me to look for you again yeah We've arrived. Hello. Ben's a bit cold. Um, we're just walking towards the entrance. And this is what we can see so far. 
Little right. focus. There you go. I've never done something like this before. Here have I. Only took us three hours to get here. Yeah, on a weekday. Well, every day is a weekend for me. But yeah, I'm just gonna um, log little bits and clips as I walk around. My, my tripod's pretty shit. Okay. to go there um, Ben's a rule breaker there's a barrier Is you? No, it's very cute. <laughs> You're so small, I have to like. I know. <laughs> yeah. So here we have some rows of little balls. <laughs> <laughs> They're made out of sledges. Oh my god, that's bad. <laughs> Zoom in, capture the detail. <gasps> bubbles. Popping bubbles. Popping bubbles. Oh. I've got hiccups. I I've got hiccups. Right, go, quick, go, and get a photo. <laughs> we finished the lights, and now we've come to a um, food and fairground, and what was the other thing? Festive food Rides. and rose. Rides. Rides. I look like something from a horror film. Yeah. Yeah. 